Hello, Steve Michael here with AppMox. Uh, wanted to do a little quick presentation for you to explain to you a little bit about dew point and humidity because we talk so much about that in our industry and so many people talk about humidity and I want to explain to you a little bit why we talk about dew point so much. And the reason that is, is for us, when we're comparing the inside and the outside air on a crawl space or an attic or whatever, we really need to know how much moisture we're dealing with, not just the percentage. And and we get really confused lots of times when people talk about humidity alone. So I just I have this brief presentation here to kind of show you how that works. And take for example here, let's say we have a crawl space, and this crawl space has a 70% relative humidity, meaning 70% RH, it's say 70 degrees. Well, that means that the air that is in that crawl space is 70% full of the water it can hold, much like this glass of ice water right or glass of water right here. Now, what happens is, as you heat air, air expands. If you ever notice, like if you heat something, it'll expand, and, and that's what air does, and when it expands, it's able to hold more water. So, let's say you have a day in the summertime, and it's 90 degrees outside, or 95 degrees. Well, relative humidity tells us, just like this glass of water, how full it is. So, if you and I take a, a bigger glass, and say this glass is 70% full of water, well, it's 70%, so from a relative humidity standpoint, the outside air is 70% full of the water it can hold. The problem is, is this glass, as you can see, is a lot bigger than this glass right here. And if we just said, okay, they're both 70% full of water, so they're the same, by humidity standards, they're the same. But for us, there's a lot more water in this outside air. And if we go and happen to ventilate a crawl space at this time, what's going to essentially happen is the air that's in your crawl space can't hold anywhere close to the amount of water the outside air can. So what essentially happens is, is when that outside air comes in, it essentially starts filling that glass up. And when that glass gets over full, it, it can't hold that water anymore. So that's when you get condensation and that's when you have real problems in a crawl space. That's why you can't ventilate at the wrong time, and that's why you have to know what the outside air has in it compared to the inside. And that is the reason why we use dew point. 